Hey, welcome back to the Explore Entropia Universe channel, where we are literally going to explore Entropia Universe. Uh, if you remember from our previous video, we have just arrived at Camp Icarus and taken our first mission, where we need to go kill five Tripudians, the mission entitled No One Likes Frogs. We're here in the starter area. We had just spoken to Sergeant Sana. So before we get started, we're going to press I for inventory, L for the edit panel and G for our interface keyboard map and we will place our pistol on number two you can place them anywhere you like that's just my preference and we're going to place our healing tool on number one those are the two items that we'll need for now and let's go kill some let's go kill some tripudians let's see there's some over there looks like they're already being harassed there's one Let's go see it. Uh, maybe this fellow's going to get it before we do. That's okay, because there will always be another one. There's one. No, oh, there's two over there. Well, there's one. One disappeared. We must have drowned. Okay, so here we go. Let's take aim. Right click. And let's shoot. Hit two. There we go. Let's kill this Tripudian Puny. Okay, not unreasonable. A little bit of ammo, a little bit of shrapnel. Let's find another one and go. Ah, there's one more. Let's just right click on this guy. It gets a little smoother as you play. You start getting used to the controls and they become more more natural. Uh, once again, some ammo and some shrapnel. Very good. Uh, where are we go? Oh, right there by the tree. There he's blending in. The little tripudian jumping along. No wonder they call them frogs. We'll back up as we shoot him. Look for... Ah, we got a bone. What could that bone be? It's... As with any item it pops up in your loot window, you can right-click on it, go to item info. Ah, okay, so this item's dropped in PvP areas. We'll have to watch out for PvP areas. Uh, let's see, description. These kind of bones are sought after by scientists. Wanting to bring them, wanting to bring back alien materials to Earth for researching. Interesting. Uh, mission item. Okay, well, if it's for a mission, then we'll probably make sure we put it in storage and hang on to it. So let's go over here. Let's find two more Tripudians, and let's complete this mission. There's Tripudian number four. There he is. Let's back up so his little friend doesn't decide to come over and help. Great friends these guys must be. The one guy's just hopping over there, hopping along, ignoring his friend over here being shot. That's okay. Ah, uh, this guy's wanting to kill our frog. Well, hmm. Heavenly Fang. I guess you wanted to kill that more than we did. That's okay. There's one over here. We'll go get it. Uh, there we go. Heavenly Fang will not kill this one. We will. popular this starting area is, but being the first mission, it doesn't surprise me. Ah, another bone, more ammo, and some shrapnel. But we have completed the mission, so let's go back to Sergeant Sana and see what she has to say, see what we get for this mission. As we run over to her, you'll notice we did gain quite a few skills over here, various laser handgun-related skills. We have a progress bar where it shows how far we've progressed in our handgun profession, in our laser pistolier uh, profession. Actually, that's laser, that's handgun skills, and this is how far we are along to maxing the EWE EP1 Neutron weapon, which indicates we are we do have maximum ability with that. So let's talk to Sergeant Sana. Let's right click on her. Yep, here's a head from one of them. I don't remember seeing a head, but okay, we'll go along with it. Ah, uh, Sergeant Sana frowns. You know, I would have taken your word for it. I mean, I saw you run around here. I guess she didn't want the frog head either. Well, you've earned re your reward. Can I give you some pointers on how to use your weapons more effectively? Which skill do you want to increase? Well, we've been using handgun. Oh, there's Heavenly Fang, the guy who stole our frog, but that's okay. He needed it too. Um, back to the skill. Let's take rifle since we've been using a handgun. That'll uh, increase our rifle skill and balance things out. You should make yourself known to Captain Hayes, the base commander. I'm sure someone would like to know you're still alive. 
Where can I find them? It says go to the camp's main building above the beach. Simply follow the path. All right, thank you and goodbye. Well, we've completed our first mission. And let's go. Oh, okay, there's a marker that says report to Captain Hayes. Let's go there as we run along the path. Looks like somebody completed a an accomplishment, an achievement, I should say, that fragmented. I'm not sure what that was. I'm sure we'll get to it also. Looks like there's new players everywhere making great use of the equipment that's given to you as a new player to get you started. If you start through um, on Planet Calypso, that is. An easy way to do that is go to www.exploreentropia.com and click on sign up for new sign up for an account and get started right away. Okay, looks like something for the gauntlet. A gauntlet orga organizer nearby. Well, uh, we're going to Captain Hayes. We'll talk to we'll we'll look at the gauntlet in a moment. Okay, there's Captain Hayes. Lots of people standing around. This guy's got a coat of some type and armor. Nice outfit on Sandra here. Looks like a rocket launcher. Vodka. Hmm. Somebody named their pet rabbit Vodka. Outstanding. All right, well, let's talk to Captain Hayes while we're here. I'm Captain Hayes, leader of the camp. Who are you and how can I help? My name's Explorer Entropia, Explorer Universe, and I just arrived from Thule. Thule, well, that's where we were. The mothership, eh, blah, blah, blah. You know, you can read this for for what you want and we're going to continue on here uh, yes indeed lucky could you really use your help uh, of course I'm happy to help that's how I get my mission rewards that's how I get the missions because I'm going to help you the camp is protected by security grid one turret seems to have gone stiff can you look at it of course I'll look at it simply activate the console we'll notify you of malfunctions what can be done okay well let's go see gun turret number two look around for a waypoint Hmm. Maybe right here. There it is. Oh, gun point number two. Gun turret two console. Let's right click on that. Okay. Hmm. Oh boy. All right. Must be a puzzle. Well, let's start with the red and black wire. No, red and yellow. Oop. Oh, try again. All right. Well, black and yellow. Ah, that worked. Okay. Now let's do red and yellow. Ah, uh, now red and black. Great guess. Nice. Okay, well, let's go back to Captain Hayes. I really did not know those order the order to do those in. It was just a very lucky guess. Uh, thanks for having a look at it. Uh, let me show you some anatomical pointers. Okay, thanks. Ah, so he increased our anatomy skill. Very good. Let's see if we hit K. We can look at our skills. And... Let's see, let's find anatomy, anatomy, anatomy! Anatomy is up to 13, so if we click on points, we can see our highest skills here. Laser weapons, anatomy, handgun, geology. Very good. Okay, are we ready to serve once more? Definitely! There's been reports of odd energy readings to the northeast. Looks like, oh, looks like we need to go find someone again. Okay, I'll do it. And more ammo! Very good, very good. We can always use more ammo. So let's go to the northeast. We can see on our radar here that it, there's a little one that corresponds to our one on the missions. So we will go that direction. And run along here. See, it looks like a butterfly flying up through the sky there. Two of them. Hmm. Pretty cool. Little graphic item there. Uh, run up the hill. What do we have? More butterflies. Ooh. Big guy. Caldeturgus Puny. Now let's just kill him along the way. See if we can. Ooh. Takes a little more than the Trapedians did. Can we do it? He's going down. Health is going down. Dead and looted. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, let's keep going to find the missing scout. 200 meters away. Run by... Who is this here? Paul Sleepy, as he kills a Caldeturgus. Or had killed it and looted it. It looks like he's going to kill another one. I bet he thought he was getting that before we did, but... 
Little does he know we weren't interested. Who's this here? Anjan Cox killing a cow to Turgus Puny? Well, you go, Mr. Cox. Let's just keep running along here, see what we can find. A great pastime while you're running along in Interpia Universe is to randomly drop a probe or, and see if you can see if you find a mineral resource. Or an in matter resource for that matter. Drop one here, see Nope, no results. But we did get a gain in our geology skill, which skills are always useful of all types. Ah, uh, looks like somebody's doing it the easy way, running along in a little Valkyrie. We should have done that ourselves. Good job, Ganarek. Okay, the missing scout, pick it up. Radio in, something on the ground. Okay. It's a dadded storage device. Transmitting the info. Burnt wreckage. Info received, not good. What is it? Well, we got more anatomy skills, so great. That should be good. They recovered the data. The scout discovered a camp north-northeast. Belonging to the robot scouts. Robots are notorious, as we learned. So what happens now? Go to their camp and sabotage it. But I'm just a new player. How would I do that? Anyhow, well, okay. Go to their camp and sabotage it with whatever it is. Sabotage whatever it is they have there. Let's show them what happens when you mess with us. Okay. Sounds good. Return once you've completed. And I've got a reward. All right, I'll be on my way. Let's go. More ammo. Yes. Can always use more ammo. All right. Well, we are going to, since this is looks a little bit farther away, let's put out our car like that other avatar did, and let's just drive. Speed this up just a little bit. Yeah, not a very fast car, is it? Maybe it's just going uphill and has to get. Maybe it just has to get started. Seemed like it was fast. Oh, there we go. Yep, we did just have to get moving. Wow, now we're really going. Up the side of the hill. Roll, little, get a little air there. Stop the top of the hill. Let's exit our car. Uh, oh, camp's still way over the hill. I thought that must have just been a waypoint. Alright, so let's go this way. We found the camp. Let's head to the camp. Race down the hill. Looks like someone else is going to sabotage it with us. Uh-oh. There are robots there. Let's jump out of our car. Let's head over here. Get our pistol at the ready, because we may just have to kill a robot. Let's kill this robot. This Gen 1. Prototype drone Gen 1. Your days are numbered. Here we go. A few more shots and it'll be gone. Okay. No loot, but they are robots, so yeah, what do you expect? Okay. Sabotage the robot camp. Let's see. Kick it. Short out. Keep looking. Let's try to short it out. Uh-oh. Whoa, there it goes. Boom. Let's run. Oh, and we just died. Great. We were killed by the uncompromising prototype Droka Gen 1. So we were killed. So it looks like we'll go to Revive Terminal at a place called Nest Lull. Hmm. Let's look at our map. Enlarge this. Well, now we're some ways away from where we want to be. So, let us, let's look in our controls here. Uh, I bet there's something we can search for. Recall vehicles. Um, okay. So now we just need to figure out where is the nearest storage. Hmm. I don't see a storage. We may have to run this one. Oh my. Okay. But let's get our, let's heal. Since we did die, let's heal our, heal ourselves up with our healing tool. And begin the, oh, my 1,200 meter run. There's got to be a storage area. 
It's got to be. Trade. No, nope, maybe there's not. Oh, boy. Okay, well, let's go. Let's make this run. Continue healing. Okay, let's go for a run. Well, we are exploring Entropy Universe. So as we're running along, let's look and see what does this have to say. Um, you just died. Well, yeah, we know that. You will shortly be restreamed to the nearest revived terminal. I wish they'd have sent us back to the other one, not this far away. Uh, you don't lose any material or skill-wise upon death. Maybe only travel time. Well, yeah, I think we've got to run 1,200 meters now. Uh, creatures do regenerate their health, so progress on damage can be undone as well, depending on how far away you revive. Alright, well, chatting while dead. While you're dead, your chat messages will look like, ooh, to everyone else. Alright, great. Talk to a medical guide for more information. I guess we can read what the dead type if we resurrect someone with a Mind Force chip. That'll be something to keep in mind. As we run the... Looks like says a thousand meters still. Outpost arrival. Looks like we had arrived at a scientific outpost when we revive. Outpost dot the landscape of Calypso, providing access to basic service terminals. Okay. Well, it looks like that was an outpost. Good. Now let's run. Let's run to Captain Hayes. Let's kind of stay away from these mobs. I don't think we want to attract any of that any of their attentions while we run Let's see I see something a Daikiba juvenile looks pretty nasty there's a nice city over there we'll have to make sure we go explore that at some point not really sure what or where it is but okay another colonist Ole Andre looks like he could be out hmm some kind of device in his hand. Not sure what that is, but okay. We'll, um, we'll just say hello as we run by. Run by. Alright. 700 meters to go. Beautiful flowers, plants, some stars in the sky. Looks like a little cloudy. Trees, rocks. And on we go. Let's look through our inventory. Looks like we still have our in matter and our list as promised we've got a little bit of shrapnel we've got two bones we've got 17,000 universal ammo we've got 10 pecs a thousand weapon cells and we are 550 meters from Captain Hayes where we need to return to getting there slowly but surely and we can drop a probe along the way. See if we find anything. Of course, we'll have to run back and get it if we do, but that'll be okay. Nope, no resources. Not uncommon. But that's, uh, that's where smart play comes in. You have to know where the resources are, when they spawn, how they spawn, and which ones you want to find. So that you can f go to the particular areas where those resources are located. 350 meters away. Run past the cow to Turgus. Probably should have given him a little more leeway, but we can. I think we can kill him if he attacks. Now yeah, let's just turn and go and do it anyways. Let's go shoot the Cataturgus. All that running made me want to do something. So let's shoot him. One more. Almost. There he goes. Oh, what is that? That is a Omegaton B101 amp. Nice. What? What is that? Amplifier for the entry-level laser weapons. Well, that's what we have. An entry-level laser weapon. 
so it adds to the damage done by our weapon nice okay now let's run back to Captain Hayes and we will put this on well, let's put it on our Solomate Rubio since our Neutron has no problem killing any of these guys 67 attacks per minute one penetration damage one burn damage and we put that on our Solomate it ah we're not skilled enough to use our Solomate completely yet we only do 51 out of 61 attacks per minute and our hit ability is only 7.2 out of 10 so we do have some skilling we need to do with laser weapons before we can use that what before we can use that rifle here we are back looks like somebody is taking off in a Sleipner very cool it's one of the many vehicles available here in Entropia Universe Captain Hayes is just around the corner finally we're back at Camp Icarus Let's see what he has to say okay I know he's here res up I know there's a lot going on in this area there he is okay Captain Hayes we did it I could hear the explosion all the way here good job for this I'll reward you with something really special a piece of CDF scout armor nice okay so we'll have some armor finally uh, if you haven't already go and have a word with Alex Buchan I think he was looking for people you can find him by going up the ramp thank you so what did we get I've ah, got a CDF scout harness huh well let's look at our inventory here let's put it on item info equip if you equip the following items will be unequipped the jumpsuit will be unequipped oh so do we run around in just a harness and our blue boxers hmm as someone laughs at us or do we put on eh, let's put back on our colonist outfit yes we do want to be modest wait until we find a, a set of another set of uh, another piece of armor to go with that so he said to go talk to Mr. Buchan up here. There's Alex Buchan. Let's see what he has to say. Hey there, you look like you know how to handle a weapon. Well, we've shot this pistol a few times. Sure, let's hear what job you have for us. Many exotic beasts roaming the wilderness. Huh? We saw a few. Five Barraclid trophies and ten Kaldaturgus trophies, and I'll make sure you're properly rewarded. Well, we can go Kaldaturgus easy enough. Let's go do this. I'm Alex Buchan, by the way. You call me Alex. Pleased to meet you. I'll see you later. More ammo. See, there's just... They really do a great job of getting you started here. Everywhere you turn, you're given a little little bit to keep you, give you some skills. All these skills that we're gaining now are going to help us later. Um, so really, I, I think the... Um, I think the Planet Calypso people do a great job of getting us prepared and, and ready to, to begin exploring Entropy Universe. Now we need to find what? Trophies from Barracled and Kataturgus. So it looks like there's a Barracled puny right there. Let's shoot it and see what happens. Oh, and there's his friend coming up because he wants in on it too. There we go. Let's get him also. Ah, it looks like uh, our count went to one out of five. Barracled trophies. Good. Nice to know we're not doing this for no reason. Crazy eyes on that guy. It's like a kicking chicken. All right. Ah, Cow to Turgus. Let's get him. Two trophies we have now. Very good. Okay, Mr. Cataturgus, we will get you. Okay, there's our loot. Let's heal up. Okay, so let's go now. Where is... Ah, there's a Cataturgus there. We need your trophy. Here 
here we come. Okay, got him. Okay, good. Got another trophy there. Looks like someone else is going to come down and compete for this guy. That's okay. Because, as always, there will be more spawns. Let's run over the hill here. Looking for red dots on the radar. Radar down in the lower right-hand corner. Ah, there's a spawn. Let's get this cow to Turgus. He is ours. Or she, whichever the case may be. Get a side view of that action. There we go. Oh, there's another one down there. See if we can get to it before those other green dots do. And looks like there's another one. Oh. Yep, yeah, can we do it? Yes, he is ours. Let's shoot this guy. Ah, there's our loot. A little muscle oil there, it looks like. Yep, muscle oil. Ah, uh, someone else got the other red dot. Well, it can take some time finding enough enough mobs to shoot. This is a very popular area. Oh, someone! Ah, oh, he got him. Who is this guy? Ichigo. He must have really wanted that that berry clad. So let's go up the hill. Look over here. This may take some time to find the rest of these guys. So I think we're going to end the video here. I will start the next one after we, after I've acquired all the trophies and go back to Alex Buchan. That's a oh, that's a Daikiba. We don't want to go see him. Not yet. So, be sure to check out the, the next video on Explore and Trippy Universe channel. If you'd like to join us in Explore and Trippy Universe with us, be sure to go to www.exploreentropia.com and sign up for your free account and join us in the, in the exploration. We'll see you then.